Cardiff City's under-18 side hosted Millwall on Saturday, looking to continue their unbeaten streak into a second month of the season. Liam Matthews dives down low early on to save this long-range effort. The away side continued their impressive start to the game with a headed effort to goal moments later, but this shot goes just over. Millwall were fortunate five minutes later as Matthews and the City defence failed to stop the Lions from taking an early advantage. The Millwall forward heading home a brilliant curling cross. City weren't behind for too long though, with Tyler Roach and Macaulay Southam combining to give Jake Watkins an easy chance in front of goal. A chance the striker took full advantage of to level the tie for the young Bluebirds. The slick 1-2 move from Roach and Southam beating the advancing Lions keeper before Watkins slot City level. Cardiff maintained strong possession of the ball after drawing level and an exquisite goal from Abdi Noor gave them a 2-1 lead. The young winger with quick footwork to beat his defender before curling the ball right-footed into the top of the Lions goal, much to the delight of the watching support. A first goal of the season for Noor, who will be delighted to get on the mark for the under-18s team. This fine run from Cardiff's David Tonda resulted in a free kick for the hosts when the fullback was bundled over the edge of the penalty area. First year apprentice Tom Burridge's sweetly struck free kick was well held by the Millwall keeper. Following a clear foul in the Lions penalty area, Cardiff were given a further opportunity from the penalty spot before the break. Upstep winger Tyler Roach to lash towards goal. Whilst Roach's penalty was well pushed away by the Millwall keeper, the young man didn't miss second time round tapping home the rebound under pressure to increase City's lead to two goals. Second year apprentice Roach led by example to fire City's third pass Lions keeper at the second attempt. Into the second half, Liam Matthews was again in action for Cardiff with a fine save to deny the away side. Adam Matthews' cousin couldn't stop the away side from reducing the deficit from this second corner, with a close-range header finally beating the young goal stopper. City were undone by another set piece, with this long-range free kick beating Cardiff defence to be headed home. This goal levelled the game at 3 all, with both sides searching for the three points. Millwall completed the second half turnaround with just minutes left. This low shot going underneath Matthews to seal the three points. Final score then, Cardiff City 3, Millwall 4. An incredible game at the USW Sports Park. Dick Bates Academy will look to work hard in the coming weeks before bouncing back from this defeat against Charlton Athletic on September the 21st. Thank you.